El verbo by tiene la misma pronunciación que la preposición by y la despedida by, de goodbye. Aunque estas palabras tienen la misma pronunciación, eso no causa confusión, porque el significado es claro en el contexto de la conversación. Como todos los verbos normales, la conjugación en el tiempo presente simple es muy sencillo. Se forma con la base del verbo, el infinitivo sin tú, para todas las personas, con la excepción de la tercera persona singular, a la cual se añade una S. Se añade la S al verbo solamente cuando la frase es afirmativa. Al cambiar la frase a una negación o a una pregunta, el verbo pierde la S. He doesn't buy. Does he buy? En realidad, no se pierde la S. Se podría decir que la S se traslada al auxiliar do para formar el does. El vocabulario Meat, fruit, vegetable, mall, clothes, grocery store, groceries. En el inglés americano, lo más común es no pronunciar la TH en clothes resultando en la misma pronunciación que el verbo to close, que significa cerrar. La palabra close es plural, entonces lleva un verbo en plural. My clothes are wet. Si se va a reemplazar close con un pronombre, se usa they y them. My clothes are wet. They are wet. Do you like my new clothes? Do you like them? La palabra clothing también significa ropa, pero clothing y clothes no son intercambiables. La palabra clothing es más usado en el comercio, como en women's clothing, men's clothing, clothing store. Las oraciones. Frases afirmativas. I buy fresh fruit at the market. He always buys nice clothes. We buy our clothes at the mall. I have to buy groceries. She wants to buy this red dress. We need fruit and vegetables. I want to buy this shirt for my father. We have enough money to buy four t-shirts. Frases negativas. I don't buy white t-shirts. He doesn't buy new books. They don't buy meat.
I'm not going to buy more clothes. Frases interrogativas. Does he always buy black suits? Do we have enough money to buy these shoes? Where do you buy groceries? Where can I buy good work clothes? Are they buying a new home? What size clothes do you wear? Frases en el tiempo continuo. I'm buying some milk. Are you buying a new car? She is buying a green blouse. Is he buying vegetables? We are buying some fruit for breakfast. They are buying some fresh bread. Ejercicios de comprensión. We need to buy some groceries. We need to buy some groceries. We need to buy some groceries. Where can I buy fresh bread? Where can I buy fresh bread? Where can I buy fresh bread? I buy fruit and vegetables at the supermarket. I buy fruit and vegetables at the supermarket. I buy fruit and vegetables at the supermarket. She buys her clothes at the mall. She buys her clothes at the mall. She buys her clothes at the mall. What do you want to buy? What do you want to buy? What do you want to buy? I am buying new clothes. I am buying new clothes. I am buying new clothes. Next, Lesson 34.